The U.S. government has taken a great lead in bringing these issues forward. Um, so why did you decide to champion Global Connect now, sort of kind of building upon what Marina just shared with us? And why do you think it matters to connect the rest of the world? Well, um, as I said, I think the real, um, the real catalyst for looking at this now was the hard data that showed uh, the consequence of connectivity so positive, as well as the fact that the gap between the connected and unconnected is just getting larger and larger. So if you're not connected, you're not just staying at standing in place, you're actually falling farther and farther behind. And so um, from our perspective, you know, we felt like it was very important to try to be a catalyst for pulling together this multi-dimensional approach and actually getting folks thinking about in their own countries about having a plan to connect their own population, which has to spring from them, as well as how do we bring to bear the resources that can allow that to happen and the innovation that comes from the private sector, as well as um, all of these sort of building block principles for, for using the internet once, once it's there. So um, I think the catalyst for us was seeing uh, the hard data that showed that connectivity, it's our instinct that connectivity mattered, but seeing the incredible tool for development that connectivity really is. I mean, if you think about it, um, if you can raise your GDP by one to two percentage points, that rising tide is gonna float all boats. And the ability to have access for all kinds of people to do things like do better and more efficient farming have access to markets and be able to sell what you're making, you know, at the high time instead of the low time. To, you know, for kids to have better access to education and, and access to the world, really. Um, so, I mean, just, it just brings all kinds of good things. And while there are certainly risks, and I agree with Marina, that we have to think about them, we can't let that stop us. We have to do this in a planful way um, and, and really make sure that we're doing everything we can to bridge the digital divide. 